everyone my name is sonia welcome to my channel i know it's a long time i have not talked to you but i was on a break but now i have come back and we are going to discuss again many interesting topics before that i will again request you all to please subscribe to this channel so that you can get informations uh, very easily and you can get notifications whenever i upload any videos First of all, I will give you a lot of thanks because you all have supported me a lot. I know that we all are struggling in very, very challenging ways. Nowadays, everyone is locked down in his or her home. But believe me, you can take this as an opportunity. I know many of us might have thought once in a life that whenever I will have time, I will do this or that. and this is the time i am also taking this opportunity to do many of my painting works and also to thinking about many of my future plans you can also take this opportunity to think about your future plans today we are going to discuss about one of the best school in france which is known as enac ecole national aviation civile So let's go back to the topic. When I talk about INAC, INAC is also known as French Aviation School. This school is very very old and very very reputed in all over the world. Education from INAC is accepted as one of the best education of the world and that is why most of its students are at very good position in the world. When I talk about INAC I will also say that this school is basically uh, in French um, aviation domain, but this school is authorized by government, French government, for many type of education such as pilot training, ATC training, um, CNS trainings, or ATSEP trainings, and that is why it has one of the best infrastructure of the world. for foreign students there are few courses which are being offered these courses are masters advanced masters and phd courses honestly it is very very difficult to get admission in phd courses because these positions are very limited and especially reserved for french students or european students if there will be no students for the position then only foreign students can get opportunities so i think if you are in your country it's very difficult to get admission in uh, phd in this school for international students if you are not european but we have other options we have two more type of educations masters and advanced masters masters are basically two years program which comprises of mini course works as well as internships so you are going to get many many things to learn and you are also going to get exposure of industrial environment i have already told you in my last uh, other videos that there are many many advantages of doing internship in france and if you have not seen these videos you can find link of this video on top right corner of this video so when you will uh, see this video you can know that how much things you learn during internship and how much support you get in the terms of financial as well as future job opportunities if you do internships so i always prefer to choose a course which are having internship opportunities luckily both masters as well as advanced masters are having internship options so you can go for both of them but masters is two years programs having different types of courses as well as uh, uh, internship opportunities while advanced masters is one year program and in one year it will be six months of course works and six months of internship opportunities but both programs have different criteria if you want to get admission into master programs you need to have your bachelor degree and there is no experience required so it is basically for beginners 
who don't have much exposure to aviation domain so this course prepared them to work into uh, any um, professional environment while advanced master is not a beginner program it is a professional programs most of the students which will be part of this program will have already experience of at least three years in domain however if you don't have experience in the domain but you are already masters in particular domain you can apply for this program honestly i will never suggest that if you are only masters and you don't have experience in particular domain then you should go for masters rather than advanced masters I'm studying this because uh, when you will come to this course, this course all presume that you already have good amount of knowledge in your domain. So you are not going to get sufficient time to know basics and this course may be very, very tough for you. So I believe that if you have a professional experience of three years, you can apply for this program. This is going to be very beneficial. But if you don't have and you are already masters, you can apply for this program. People always choose master programs if they want to do PhD in future. But if you want to do PhD in future, then advanced master program is not for you because you are not going to get admission until you are already masters. You are not going to get admission into PhD based on this advanced master only it will not be considered as a master education for phd purpose so note down this now if i come to, um, to different programs you can go to inac website www.inac.fr like i am on this website i can tell you that there are different types of programs in masters master of science in international air transport system engineering Master of Science in Aerospace International Air Operations. Besides this, there are many other type of advanced masters and masters. For example, Master of Science in uh, Master of Science in uh, ATM Avionics, Master of Science in uh, Air Management, Airport Management, um, Master of Science in Drones, Master of Science in in Master of Science in GNSS, Signal Processing, Urban Navigation, Software Receiver. So you can find details on INAC website. And, and if I talk about Advanced Masters, we have different types of Advanced Masters also. Advanced Masters in Air Navigation System Engineering and Operations, which is related to uh, CNS, GNSS and ATM options. You can choose any one of these options. Advanced Masters in Aerospace Project Management, Advanced Masters in Aviation Safety Aircraft Worthiness, Advanced Masters in Air Transport Management, Airport Management, Safety Management, Unmanned Aircraft, Airlines Operations, Aircraft Life Management, etc. etc. Good thing is that all these programs are somehow connected with professional back, uh, companies. So you can directly get information and lectures from professional environment and the result is that you are going to get uh, no, uh, many good informations what is going on in current domains. So you can go on this website, you can look for different types of uh, advanced masters and masters and then you decide that in which you want to enroll yourself. For me both of them is good. But if you are professional like me, then advanced master is better choice for you. But choose this option in your domain. Now we will talk about fee. When I talk about fee structure, in 2019, it was 13,000 euros for one year for advanced masters. And here there is no option to pay in installments. You have to pay your fees before starting of course. So you have to be ready. With 13,000 euros. For uh, Master of Science, this fee was approximately 15,000 euros. This fee may vary based on year to year because every year universities used to increase some amount of fee. I don't know about this year. This year is going to be very tough. You all know about this. So I will suggest that if you have yet not planned for 
your education in this year then this year you should give to do your research and prepare for examinations because most of the scholarship deadlines are already over so you are not going to get finance opportunities and uh, it is better that you wait and we don't know that what's going on to in september because in september your session is going to start but you can take these opportunities to prepare yourself for next year so this was a, a fee structure you can see that even uh, it is two year programs of masters but fee is rather similar 13000 for advanced master 15000 for advanced master so it's not going to change much but in masters you are going to get many different other opportunities such as participation in conference participation in seminars you can go to work to the companies and you will get more opportunities to learn because courses are framed in very good way while in advanced masters you will feel that you are very stressed the force are very very heavy so you have to be prepared in both way so i told you about two major courses advanced masters and masters and i told you about admission um, fee and one more fee is admission fee which you have to pay every time when you will apply for a course and this fee is 70 euros this fee you have to pay if you want to apply for admission in a particular course so it is important that you apply in selectively some courses which you feel that you can get in so that uh, you don't have to pay 70 euro for so many times for different types of courses so this was all information in next video, I'm going to tell you about the documents which you have to prepare for admission into master's or advanced master's. I'm also going to discuss about in uh, finance opportunities. Uh, there are some scholarships which are specifically for INAC students. You can apply for that scholarships. Without, uh, besides this, there are many other types of scholarship also. So this was all information. I hope you might have uh, received some benefits of these informations. So uh, I will wait for uh, you in my next video. Till then, Tata, see you and bye.